Hey, I'm Grump. I'm not so Grump. And we're the game Grumps. Hey guys, welcome back. Bonsoir, no. We're playing- what language was that? I don't- I might have been a mixture of several languages. Bonsoir, no hello! <laughs> oh shit, what do you have to say, Navi? After you get into the water, if you hold down A, you can dive. I bet there's some interesting things underwater. Hmm, you go down there, it's like, <laughs> all the shit she wants you to get for her. Yeah, it's like her- it's like her laundry. <laughs> <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Oh man, that's weird that that's down there. Hey, could you just grab that and bring yeah, it back? A lot of tiny pants down here. Yeah, since you're already there. <laughs> yeah. It's not a big deal. That's cool. Hey, my tax forms, could you just fill those out? <laughs> They're really small. <laughs> but the return is large, am I right? <laughs> Damn, yo! Uh, I mean, uh, it isn't. <laughs> There's no way I could afford to pay you for the work that you're doing. Because Whoa. I don't- I didn't get a huge return or anything. Would you have gotten hurt if you jumped there? Hold on, um... I think I fucking- am I doing this right? Are you meant to- It's coming back up and then I can jump, yeah. What the- oh! Boy, that was hard for me to tell. I really do have a hard time with 3D depth perception. Well, th this was like at the beginning of the era, so like, it wasn't perfect. Right. You know, like, even they had problems with it back then. Mm -hmm. Even though they were fucking Nintendo and like... Geniuses at their craft. Definitely geniuses. I mean, like, dude, when you think of what was going on in 98, or whenever this was released, like, this is a pretty amazing step forward. Yeah. Oh, definitely. Dude, I mean, all the credit that this game gets, like, it totally deserves. Whoa. whoa. I'm not saying it's like, it, it just doesn't have, like, a whole lot of staying power. In oh, game. yeah, no, I'm, <clears throat> any, <coughs> excuse me, any praise I give this game, uh, will be, like, just me thinking out loud, and we'll have no, like, greater, like, message to you. Like, this is a good game. Like, I don't fucking care. I don't all. care either. Yeah. Did Whoa. I just walk yeah, through Yeah, you the... sure did. Whoa. I saw that, though. It already happened. Whoa. Can I, can I, like, redo that? I think it was just a one-time thing. How did I do that? I, it was, I was just pushing against the- Whoa! Okay. Aaron, you're in my backs. I'm Boxman. <laughs> Here I am. I've got a moon and a fairy on my face. Wait. <laughs> it's like Han Solo right before the carbonite. Like, I know. <laughs> <laughs> wow. So if you go in through the corner, you can just go into the box. I think it only happens once in a blue moon. Like a moon, like on this block? Sure. Hold on, this guy. Yeah, you can replicate it if you just go. Whatever. Fuck it. Yeah, I guess it's not. Fuck it. I don't give that a fuck. amazing. But still, kind of cool. Did I discover some new speedrunner tactics? Oh fuck. I don't see how that would help you <laughs> accomplish it. Somebody fast. fucking discovered that if you just like hop through a, a door at some point, you just warp to the end of the game. D really? Yeah. Isn't that fucking ridiculous? It's. I'll never understand how people find this shit. Like. Did- did you just hear about, like, the Mortal Kombat, like, screens that they just found in the original arcade game? What? Ed Boon. Uh, Toasty Guy. From, yeah. Yeah. Well, I don't know if he's the Toasty Guy, but... It's either Tobias or Boon. Yeah. Um, but one of the original programmers of the original Mortal Kombat, um, uh, has been saying for a long time there's still some, like, Easter eggs in that first cabinet game that people never discovered, and they discovered, like, a week ago or whatever, um, screens, uh, that you can access before you start the game, where you can, like, watch everybody's ending, you can, like, change your initials, like, on the top scores and stuff. Um, yeah, it's just, like, a bunch of random, cool, like, inside stuff. But, like, to get to it, you have to push, like, Block on player one ten times. Block on player two five times. Block on player one three times. Block on player two two times. Like shit like that. But like, I they showed the guy doing it. And it's like it's like how the fuck did you ever figure that out? It's like do people just sit there and just like hit buttons randomly? But I mean, I guess. I guess that would be the case it just came if it took 25 years, but yeah, seriously, still kind of, kind of wild. Get the fuck Whoops. out of here, fucking skull tall. I don't need your shit right now. I really don't need your shit right now. Is it? Yeah, this is the place to go. Cool. It's down fucking here. I'm just, just dicking around right squ now. Nah, no problem. Hey, dude, can I just say, huh. since we recorded episodes, well, not counting the first two 
Zeldas yeah. of this playthrough. Um, we've been through a lot of shit. Oh yeah? Well, I have. I fucking went to MAGFest. Oh, sweet. Did that show. Um, we released the Under the Covers album, we released like, Take On Me, and a bunch of cover videos, and... Hell yeah. My whole fucking life is different now. Dude, how was the show? It was unbelievably awesome. Um, the... Let me just say real quick... Let me say real quick to all the NSP fans out there, um... I know that's not everyone, so I don't want to, like, waste too much time on it, but like... Uh... Just thank you so, so much, um, for coming out and supporting us, uh, at the show, and buying the album. Like, the fucking cover album did a lot better than we could have ever fucking dreamed. And it's because of you guys. You support us and you're amazing and it means the world. And like, the show, uh, you know, for Brian and I, and all the twerp guys, like, collectively, we've all been in the music industry for like 60 years, you know, like you put them all, all the years together. Probably not that much, but like close to it. And that was the best show we've ever played, like, wow. for all of us, yeah. There was like... The, it was Oops. it was packed. It was like 4,500 people. Like, a thousand people got turned away at the door, we were told. Holy crap. Yeah. Wait, how many people were there? Uh, I mean, I guess 5,500 showed up. Whoa. I know, unbelievable. And like, so thank you to all of you, especially the people that couldn't get in. I'm sorry about that. We don't, just didn't have any control over it. Um, and uh, crap, man. isn't it unreal? And the, the other amazingly cool thing, and I'll I'll never. I had in ear monitors for the first time, ever. Yeah. During that show, like for anyone who doesn't know, like um, most professional singers, like if you see their ears, they probably have like something that looks like earplugs with a wire connected to them, and what that is is like it's a mix of what's going on on stage. Um, being pumped directly into your ears. Mm -hmm. So you can hear everything perfectly, you can hear your own voice. Um, they have stage monitors too, but they're not as good, you know, you can't hear yourself as well. And sometimes they don't have anything. Like when we did the Steel Panther show, I, or, or like the Comic-Con show, like, you're just singing and you can't hear your fucking voice at all. You're just like, I hope this is right, yeah. you know? And it really, it's this, I'd never used in-ear monitors because I couldn't afford them before. And, uh, that was the first time, and, like, I almost wanted to cry during the show, because I was- it was the first time I'd ever performed where I could actually hear myself. And I was like, oh my god. It's like the difference between, like, drawing something in a pitch black room where you can't see shit, and yeah. then it with the light on. Um, That's fucking rad, dude. So it felt so good. And the other th cool thing about it, um, is that, uh... Let- whoa, whoa. Dude, it's Goma. Are you friend or foe? <laughs> I'm here to help! I am parasitic armored arachnid Goma! <laughs> Let me hug you with many arms! Um... Uh, oh, so I'll just finish this up real quick. Um... Like, that's... You can say whatever you want, dude. This is the first boss. Oh, so cool. Not so, super hard. <laughs> the, um... The mix is- goes right into your ears, but they're such effective earplugs because they're custom made to fit into your ear. Yeah. That they block out all other sound. So, like, there was one part of the concert- Actually, we, we did Everybody Wants to Rule the World, and there's a big, um... Uh, what's it called? Um, a big instrumental break there. Yeah. And I turned off- the, You have, like, a little pack attached to you that controls the volume. Uh-huh. And I turned off my pack, um... Uh, in the middle of it, so like, I see, I'm on stage, I, I'm dancing around, I see Twerp going crazy, just playing their hearts out. I look out in the crowd, everyone's going batshit nuts, and like, it's total silence for me. Whoa. I was like, oh my god, it felt like I was on drugs. It was so, so fucking cool. Um, not to say that drugs are cool, kid, well, whatever. <laughs> Drugs are cool. What are you gonna do? But like, so that was it. Something that's like being on drugs is cool. Y yes, absolutely. So nice job. You fucking crushed that. Yeah. Well, he's fucking. He's a little. He's a little pussy. <laughs> Great. He's a little puss. <laughs> little kitty cat. Armored arachnid pussnoid. He's a little ball sack. You just kick him and he goes. Ooh 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 ooh. Ow 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 ow. I just remembered the thing I was gonna come back to from the menu screen of the first episode. 
When what we were naming the character Slurp or whatever yeah. the fuck his name is. Hold on, Slurp. let's see if I can like... There's some, there's some like glitch here. I don't know if there's like, like something I can do. Really? Yeah. <laughs> I don't think it is. What is it? <laughs> I, I don't know. I, I, I was trying my best to remember what it was. If you if you like jump attack the door there, you can like warp to the end of the game or something. Oh, that's the door. Yeah. Okay, got it. Um, yeah, like, uh... What the heck was it gonna- oh yeah, when I was in second grade, I was obsessed with Stegosaurus to the point where everyone was like, shut up about Stegosaurus. Uh -huh. And I just remembered like, we- it was a group thing and we had to name oh. our group. And I was like, what about the Stegoroids? And, <laughs> and then everyone was like, no. And then I fucking stormed out of the room and cried. I knew that thou wouldst be able to carry out my wishes. <laughs> Let's just ignore what a bitch I was when anyway. I was seven. <laughs> It's so funny. Now, I have yet more to tell ye. Wouldst thou listen? Oh my god, remind me I have something to tell you about you and ye okay. when we get a chance. Maybe next episode. No, Slurp. Thou must know my time is short. Oh, okay. Uh, Alright, just, you know, don't honor my yeah. my request. I'm about to become 30 million toothpicks. Uh, listen carefully. Uh, of the desert cast this dreadful curse upon me. Oh no. It's Dutch Elm disease. <laughs> the dreadful man of the desert. You mean you mean an Indian guy? Are you, ta are you talking about an Indian guy? That's fire. racist as fuck, dude. Oh boy. That's, that's racist, dude. It is. You're talking about a Saudi Arabian guy? That's racist, you <laughs> fucking Deku tree. You fucking racist ass Deku tree. Just because people aren't trees like you doesn't mean they aren't people too, you fucking racist piece of shit. I cannot. Oh, he's talking about Ganon. I cannot even begin to describe in English words how bad this microphone smells. For it is in that <laughs> sacred realm that one will find the divine relic, the Trifurst, which contains <laughs> the essence of the god. Trifurst. Okay, great. Oh shit, it's raining. This is cool, right? This looks cool. <laughs> now into hyperspace we go. <laughs> Chewy, punch it! <laughs> Get it? <laughs> Three golden goddesses descended upon- God damn it! <laughs> Goku fired three different Kamehameha blasts. Dim, the goddess of power. One was Naryu, pink. the goddess of wisdom. One was blue and cool. And the other one was green and, and weird and made everyone uncomfortable. <laughs> For- God, I fucking- <laughs> The pink one came first. The, king, the pink one laid a fire fart. <laughs> And then it made the Death Star explode. What the fuck is going on, man? I don't know. If I could only read faster. Oh, that's right. They created the Earth and then Poop the nuggets life. flew through the fog. <laughs> Din! With her strong, flaming arms, she cultivated the land and created the Red Earth. Oh, beautiful. I mean, gross. I mean... Nar Ni Nairu <laughs> poured her wisdom onto the Earth and gave the spirit of law to the world. Wow. Shit's cool, right? It's blue. That's what I'm talking about. And then Shafori. Ferore diarrheaed horrifyingly <laughs> yeah. everywhere. With her rich soil produced all life forms who would uphold the law. Did that say uphold the law? And then their fourth sister, Sephora. <laughs> Yo, she opened up like a hair shop. <laughs> Shit's expensive, but damn, it's worth it. She sold many overpriced products <laughs> and lotions. The three gig fuck, and the golden sacred triangles remained at the point where the goddesses left the world. Since then, the sacred triangles have become the basis of our world's providence. It looks really good for N64. And the resting place, I agree, of the triangles has become the sacred realm. <laughs> like the thing Link is comment. Oh man, it looks pretty good for a 64. Shut up, Link. Let me finish, I'm dying. <laughs> yeah, please give me a second. Jesus, you can see my leaves falling off as thou, we speak. Thou must never allow the dessert man in black armor to lay his hands on the sacred triffers. Dessert is two S's. I know, it's delicious. Because you want more dessert and you want less desert. Oh, that's pretty good. Yeah. Unless you're a camel who can't eat chocolate. <laughs> thou must never suffer that man with his evil heart to enter the sacred realm of legend. Ooh. That evil man who cast the death curse upon me and sapped my power. See, sapped. With that's some a, fava beans. It's a play on words. That's a tree joke. Because of, <laughs> because of that curse, my end is nigh. Through your, though your valiant efforts to break the curse were successful, I was doomed before you started. 
Yes. So thanks. I will pass away soon, but do not grieve for me. I mean... <laughs> Don't grieve for me! Just feel like shit, because you couldn't fucking do anything. I've been able to tell you of all these important matters. If you want to maybe throw a flower on my grave or something, then, you know, yeah, it's, it's like, that's it's cool. whatever, you know. At least I got... And if my paintings can raise in value after I die, then that'll be great, too. To love you? <laughs> this is Hyrule's final hope. <gasps> oh! <laughs> the whole time. Oh. Slurp. Go now to Hyrule Castle. Oh. There, thou wilt surely meet the Princess of Destiny. Oh. Take this stone with you. <laughs> the stone that man wanted so much that he cast the curse on me. And then take these scrolls, and this sword and shield, and this horse, and god damn, I have a lot of shit to give you. Yeah. You're just like, I don't, where do I put it? I don't have a bag. Dude. Dude. Nice. Nine. He like has this really like, beautiful death scene, and then he's like, at the end, he's like, ah! <laughs> Dying hurts! <laughs> and then he just shits himself and like falls over. <laughs> ah! <laughs> mommy, mommy, mommy! <laughs> Take this green jello <laughs> in this Fabergé whatever the fuck it yeah. is. The future depends upon thee, Slurp. Thou art courageous. Mm. Thou art sexy. Thou art Navi the Fairy. Help Slurp to carry out my will. I entreat ye, Navi, good by Remember the Alamo. <laughs> he just like explodes for no reason. <laughs> oh, he's all gray now. Yeah. Ew, gross. What an eyesore. Can I'm sure he's just sleeping! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, let's get out of here! Woohoo, boy! Go goodbye, Great Decker Tree! <sighs> Later! <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh was that her, sad. like, little moment? Yeah, she was like, ah, I miss you. Yeah. Alright, next time. Wait, next time on Game Rooms. Yeah. Yeah. See you later, babies. See you, booze. Bye. Great Decker Tree did de de dead. Dead forever. Great take your treat. Did did dead. He did dead. Did did dead. He did dead.